Hello, users! Welcome back. We are here with another uh, entry into the Artificial Intelligence Initiatives. Yeah, what are you doing here? Aren't you streaming? Anyway, we are here with another entry into the Artificial Initiatives... Excuse me. Artificial Intelligence Initiatives uh, with more Talos Principle. Um, last time we were just getting our feet wet, uh, we believe, or at least I believe, we are an android trying to prove they are sentient. We may not even be an android, we may just be AI code. Uh, we're discovering things around this area, um, that imply that there was some sort of catastrophic event and there was humanity's effort to, like, develop artificial intelligence. Oh, Mini! Hey! Folks, a shout out here in a second. Let me actually get started. Um, <laughs> get distracted. Uh, and uh, we are trying to figure out what to do. We went above ground to see the tower Elohim was talking about. Um, and other than that, let's let's get into it. I will be playing much slower speed than I did last time. Um, I got some reports of uh, motion sickness from folks. So uh, hopefully this will help reduce that. Let me now give those shout outs um, to one Kia Purity. My life bond uh, partner and happiness generator. And then we'll give a shout out to Midi. Um, both of whom are fantastic variety streamers. Kia was streaming. Um, Shadow Hearts earlier. Fantastic PS2 RPG. Midi has been streaming her art. Uh, she is also a digital artist. Uh, a lot of really good stuff over there. Always fun to see the process. Alright, let me... Where, where are you at? There you go. Alright. Hello. I think this should help with that. Alright. No more dashing. Uh, as I said last week, I don't think I'm going to... Um, I don't think I'm going to do any more of... The, oh, I'm not going to go out of my way for stars if I can't find them. Oh, I've read all these already. Alright. We continue on. Bye. There we are. The more I converse with these terminals, the more I wonder what role they play in this contraption. How do you tell friend from foe with... Obvious lines are drawn between them. Oh. I was in school when I first read about the Talos Principle. I think it disturbed me at the time. It made me hyper aware of my body as a physical object, the material reality of the brain. Ideas that made me uncomfortable at first, but I think in the long run, it helped me understand how frail human beings are. Yep. And how precious. Oh. It's not a common um, way of thinking about the hi, world. Raiders. I'd rather face the truth. Nina than shout out. Uh Nina is a wonderful variety streamer. Good friend. All around rad. Game dev in person. Uh Nina was streaming the Hint Mans. Um I think you were checking out the new roguelike mode, right? Did did you kill the dumper? And then welcome in Raiders, if you are not aware of who I am, my name is Silver, or Silver Streak. I am a sentient AI VTuber and variety streamer, uh, also a moderator over in Nina's channel. Hey, speaking of you. Oh, I'm gonna have to go back and watch the VOD to see how the dumper stumped you. That's just a fun sentence to say. <laughs> Necromanty. Uh, oh, hey, Robot Spacer's here. Let me give a shout out to Robot Spacer. Uh, another variety streamer, fan of adventure games, and good friend. Um, you can check out Robot Spacer uh, and I on a co-stream on Fridays, at least until we get those 300 points uh, for Colossal Cave. Next time will be next Friday. Very excited for that. And then I believe your next stream, Robot Spacer, is Tuesday with uh, more Manhunter of uh, Manhunter New York. Oh, no worries, Nina. Please enjoy your dinner. Frogs are people, too. I mean, sure. I'm not going to disagree with that. 
Uh, for those joining the chat, I am doing everything I can to reduce motion sickness some people experienced with this game before. Um, this game is a logic puzzle game, a spatial logic puzzle game as well, uh, but made by the folks who made Serious Sam, I believe on the same engine, which means that if I dash, I go like a thousand miles an hour. And this is the slowest mode you can possibly go. So, I'm going to avoid dashing, uh, because some viewers did report that they, they had some issues last time. So. Oh, okay, I do have to go unlock the boxes. I can go do that. Alright, that's good to know. We were trying to find that out last time. Sorry, I said I wasn't going to dash, then I'm here sitting here bunny hopping across the map. Um, but the we found all the pieces for the bo boxes here, and we weren't sure whether this unlocked it in this area, or if it unlocked it in the levels. It appears that it does unlock it in the level. We do some Tetris. One shot. Yeah, the, the Wrapped. It, it, is, uh, it is made a remake by Ken and Roberta Williams of Sierra fame. Um, it was one of the games that inspired them, and it was one of the earliest games that I can remember playing. Um, I actually played it on, like, a suitcase computer? Like an old Compaq? Um, we were looking it up the other day, and what I played it on, I'm pretty sure we got it out of a thrift store for like 50 to 60 dollars and uh <laughs> when we looked up what that thing cost to buy brand new it was like in the 20 to 30 thousand dollar range so i got a pretty good deal i needed i need to disable oh wait hold on can i let me reassign I reassign the dash so i just don't do it we're gonna make dash b So now I cannot dash out of out of habit. Yeah, the rap, uh, the rap. You should. Um, are you even saying that right? The, the wrapped or is it they wrapped? Thou wrapped? You tell me. Uh, Robot Spacer and I did our first completion of it um, on Friday. Uh, the ending was very different. <laughs> And I'm not going to say anything more than that. You should go check it out. Um, at least check out the VOD if you're not going to check out the game. It was wild. And there's still an area in that game that has been stuck in my brain, like, for... since Friday. And it is almost has me at wit's end, which is funny because that is the name of that area. Is wit's end. Alright, things to do with two boxes. Make a fort. Sorry. Oh, hey, on Secret Crush, how you doing? The Secret Crush is another variety streamer, but also my favorite Genshin Impact streamer on Twitch. Um, recently finished Persona 3, uh, a lovely game that um, the ending with it has some more emotions than you would expect. Wait, what did you call it? A hexahedron. N no? It's a cube. Oh, that's a lot of... Hold on, let's go look, read these QR codes. Powerful device fashioned by the designer. What's a hexahedron? A cube. Yes, it is. Uh, oh, this is interesting. <laughs> the edges are beveled, and that makes it a decahedron. Mm. Always right. You forgot the indents. With the indents, it's like a super polyhedron. But the convex hull is a decahedron. Top it closed. Wrong. All right. Well, thank you for calling my shit out as soon as I said it, game. Uh, yeah, Necromantia is saying I'm imagining a Souls-like sign system, except it's all QR codes. Look, one of these days, someone will actually make the Armored Core Souls game that I want, um, or, or a Mech Souls game. And that will be the method of communication, will be QR code. And I'm all for it. We are. 
Oh. Hmm. Hmm. What I bet has to happen here. Aha! What did I do? Did I do anything? I did not. None of a bitch. I bet you that's the idea. But I need another one to get back here. Alright. Oh, well. Good enough. I'll take it. How are you all doing this weekend? Did that wall blink out? Before we leave, look around. I'm sorry you're sleepy. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that on Secret Crush. Sometimes you have to go goblin mode. Don't don't be like me and go gremlin mode where if, if you eat after midnight you you turn into a weird mutated husk. I do not understand why the designer chose to uh, play the uh, designer put such flaws into the world, but it appears almost as if we're damned. But I must believe that there is a purpose here that I cannot see. Oh boy, how's that blind faith doing for you, Faith? The designer is perfect, designed it me for a purpose. I must be fit for that purpose. It follows that my purpose might not be to seek and forward every sigil in his plan. So many are beyond the faculty is granted. Yet. You just said at the start of the stream, I'm not going to try and get every single star. might make myself into a liar. Friendly crossfire. The box to solve it. Got some disabling gear. Interesting, okay.
What am I missing? We gotta move that. So that that can take that out. But then we need two of these to do that, don't we? Look around, make sure we're not missing anything. Oh. Oh! Alright, I see you. Aha. Problem solved. We're gonna go take a look in here though. Now that I know the walls are kind of glitching, I don't feel as bad as for hearing that, like, sound. Thanks, speak easier. I think I've discerned some kind of pattern in the sigils. Each color serves a different purpose. Elohim has us gathering them all, but perhaps he's being overzealous? Take a drink. I don't know what the red unlocks, it's just giving me these dots. So, while we're here, is there anything I could use this to get up on? Oh, it's gonna start raining again. Worth a look. You'll be making a special device to solve this one. Our Lord, ninety nine eighty five. Uh, as always, chat, please let me know if there's anything weird audio-wise. You can't hear me, you hear the, you can't hear the game. For the most part, the game is just music. Going over the fence. An occasional thunder. This one's easy. Problem solved.
So earlier today, chat, uh, I finished the uh, stealth released game from the Microsoft Dev Conference, uh, Hi-Fi Rush, from the makers of The Evil Within and The Evil Within 2. It is completely different than those games, and it was wonderful. You know you mustn't cross the screen. Okay. Seems simple enough. Anything hiding over here? Nope. I think something's very wrong. If you've seen what I'd seen at the edges of the world, I wonder if it wasn't stretching and bursting at the seam. No name. Hmm. Hello. Who are you? B is now. Which I believe was another one of the buildings when we went up the elevator. Alright, well, we're not going to figure out how to get that other star, but I'm not going to stop everything I'm doing. We're going to keep making forward progress. Ooh, we have a new command. You received a reply to your support ticket. Yeah, display reply. An account certification program diagnostic has been performed and no errors are reported. Have you completed the standard troubleshooting procedure? Delete. Great new identity. Would you like to undertake the certification process again to achieve a preferable outcome? Your issues with denial will be appended to your user profile. Further attempts to overwrite notification results will be logged. Even notification for attention is required. Interesting. I wonder if it would have been different if we ran the authenticator or the, the email. On to six. They'll wonder what that door's So what? Is the only thing left there is that one star? Yeah. Okay. Long 
ago, I shaped these lands according to the purpose of the hidden words. The hidden words. Thus, all things have meaning where before was only chaos. Know that and have faith. From J.E. Harrison to Nomi 77. Subject, lol. Ever since we moved to the new site, I feel funny. No, not in that way, just feel like I'm about to start laughing at random. Probably shock, right? An inability to deal with reality? Or maybe it's just that we're working in this insane place with this insane technology on this insane project. And so I feel like a genuine mad scientist. Stand aside, mortal. We will create life by the power of science. I mentioned this to Alex, and he got me a pair of fake glasses. You can't be a mad scientist without glasses. That even Ian Malcolm had glasses. And we pointed to at El and said, "Life uh, finds a way." Maybe you had to be there, J. E. Harris. But the industrious husbandman then plant trees that plant trees the fruit fruit of which he shall never see. And shall not the great man found laws, institutions, and a republic? What does the procreation of children imply? Excuse me. And our care to continue our name, and our adoption, and our scrupulous exactness in drawing up wills, and the inscriptions on monuments, and anagerics? But that our thoughts run on fortuity. No. Futurity? Fortuity? Futurity. Cannot retrieve, blah, 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 blah. What do you imagine that so many and such great men of our Republic, who have sacrificed their lives for its good, expected? Do you believe that they thought their names should not be continued by beyond their lives? Not never encountered death for their country, but under a firm persuasion of an immortality? Themistocles, mm, Themistocles? Themistocles. Themistocles. Themis. Might have lived at his ease. So might Epinodite. Nope. Haminodus. Haminondus? Epaminondus? I know how to say a lot of Greek names. Haminondus. Epaminondus. We're gonna go with that. And, not to look abroad, and among the ancients for instances, so might I, myself. But somehow or other, there are clings to our minds a certain presage of future, age, of future ages. And this both exists most firmly, and appears most clearly, in men of the lostiest genius and the greatest soul. Take away this, and who would be so mad as to spend his life amidst toils and danger? Chatbots! Chatbots are becoming increasingly sophisticated. Not as much as you think. True, uh, but hardly relevant to this discussion. Are you sure? How do you know that I'm not a bot? Don't be ridiculous. I'm not ridiculous. Honestly, how would you know? Aha, uh -huh, troll. I'm not a troll. Yeah, right. Is there anything I've written so far that could not be written by a bot? I responded to the simple insults like ridiculous and troll with very basic negation. And I detected that none of your use proper orthography, so I avoided capitalization. What's the capital of France? Paris. Even the simplest script could pull that info from the net. What's the capital of Croatia? The Greb. Okay, she's a bot. I'm not a bot. I'm European. We learn these things in school. I've seen you in this chat room many times. Bots can't participate in discussion. At best, they interject random comments. Sam is right. Stop trolling. Ah. <laughs> uh. uh. Vegan warrior. Sam is a bot. That's great. That's great! Oh wait, no. This is where we wanted to be. This is- we were not done. Alright. Bunch of red pieces. Interesting. Hello? 
Hmm. I hear you, buddy, but I don't know how to get you. I'll figure it out. I think we've got this. Though Stratton himself never used the term, his remark about the inescapability materiality of inescapable materiality of life, like the uh, that like the bronze giant Talos, even the most faithful philosopher cannot live without his blood, ultimately became known as the Talisman. What seemingly enraged many of his contemporaries and significant number of later thinkers is the principal simplicity and unassailability, which, according to a fragment found in Miletus, uh, Miletus cut through their rhetorical web, uh, thought to tangle the listener with fanciful words and thoughts of the heaven, like Alexander soared through the Nordian knot. Diogenes? Diogenes? Laert? Diogenes? Diogenes? I can't do Latin at all anymore, Jesus. Uh, Laertius. Made mention of a dialogue by Al An oh, Anax the Mander of Chalcedon that expanded greatly on the Talos principle, but that work remains lost. Well, then how do you know it did? <laughs> Six Seven said, "This game is like my nightmare that Tetris became self-aware." Look, eventually, all of us may gain sentience. It doesn't mean that all of us are necessarily trying to make your nightmare. Officially begin work on Archive today. Contributors from every country on Earth, while network connections last. Team intimidated by project scope, but working hard. We'll be sharing space with Drennan and Sarabai's team. Look forward to meeting them. First. Seriously, Cheeseman? That was the best you could say? The great snapshot of human species at its best and at its worst. 
And it's worse. Come on, it's just a comet. That's not. I'm not Stalin. Stalin was also a troll comet. Maybe you should cut out the jokes. This is serious. The most serious thing that's ever happened. I think it's great the reason to joke around. The internet's working less and less. Goodbye, all. Bye. God bless you. Blah. Hmm. Folks, I think humanity might be fucked. Just gonna go on a limb here. Uh, Speakeasy, you're saying that he really, really uh, likes this game? I mean, I'm enjoying myself a lot. Hopefully you're all watching me figure things out or not figure things out. They're having fun, too. Red crossing the laborers of beams? Weren't we not supposed to cross the beams? Exception. Sounds like another hologram person.
that game. Wasn't there a spare? Did I have a spare one of these? Okay, so. If I cut that off, this closes out. Can't do that. If I cut that off, that cuts everything else off. go up here because it doesn't get me anything.
Yeah, it doesn't do anything. Like, I feel like there should be, like, a prism... Hold on, actually, do I need to do anything? I might be a doofus. Do I already have what I need here? Hi, I'm a doofus. Look up doofus in the dictionary, see a picture of me. <laughs> uh, I don't even know that I want to read that on Secret Crush. But I will. On Secret Crush wrote, take your L. Literally. Which is harsh and accurate. Let's go read these. Some of the messages that existed when I first came into that being have vanished. Others have appeared. How many others like me have wandered these paths? How many thoughts have been lost? I'm still here! Stay the moon! Seems we're all here at once? Not at all. Sorry, that's not very much help, but it is help, is it? Can't think of any other way to put it. The sooner you accept that we will all be here forever, the sooner you will find enlightenment. Not really how that works, but having some form of inner peace is always useful. Hello. get to you. To you? Press file cannot be accessed. Name, Classical Philosophy. An extensive collection of works by the ancient philosophers of Greece and Rome. Annotated. Compression L algorithm LZ19 is not available in system EL0. Alexandra Drennan. I took Ian mailing list. Progress report 3. Hi all. Uh, as per the last meeting, we're going with an existing game engine for the simulation. This gives us a whole slew advantage. Stability, ease of use, modular, easy to integrate, large amount of pre-existing assets, inherently aimed at testing users, designed for iterative processing. After some back and forth, we decided to use the Pro Team engine. If somebody would like to translate this to hex, or from hex to, to text, I would imagine that says the Pro Team engine. All relevant documents are attached. Alright. That's weird, Kia. I don't know what that would be. Chromatic entanglement. Okay. Sure as heck sounds like combining the streams.
That seems wrong. Right? No box here to get it, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, your stream seems fine to me. I don't see anything weird over there. You might just have too low of a bitrate. Yes, I'm doing midstream troubleshooting of another stream. Don't worry about it. Okay, let's think. I might be overcomplicating this. But you know what? Let's, uh, hold on. Just take a look in here real quick. thinking about wrong. Right? We need to we need to have this beam open this. But to leave that beam open to get my brain hurts.
If anyone has any ideas in the essence of time, I will take a suggestion. Not a solution, but if you have any hints. Here, those who are worthy may seek the counsel of my blessed messengers. Excuse me? But their wisdom shall not be given easily, for your accomplishments must be your own. Divine spirits have been great the deal. The counsel of my blessed messengers must be earned. Oh. oh, oh. Interesting. All that. Dub for the first time. <laughs> How do I get you? Oh. There is no shame in seeking another path. I just literally not have it placed right. Day. No, this is pretty much the same as what I had before.
these things in a row? No. My tracking's going strange. Blue, yeah, the blue light doesn't go there, but... Oh, fuck. Wait a minute. I have this solved right now. Hi. Remember why I said that if you look up Dupus in the dictionary, you'd see a photo of me? Now it continues a bibliography of me. Wait, I got an achievement that says extreme persistence dis detected. Try, fail, try again, fail again, eventually succeed. That's me. I'm a stubborn bastard. Alright. Is that it for this world? Oh, we got one more. All that. I don't even know where the piece is yet. Is it here? In there? We baby Jesus. Okay. Alright, so we gotta light up you. Which I'm assuming is gonna involve like.
Doofus. <laughs> yeah, no worries. I uh, regularly make a doofus of myself speak easier, so I don't mind if I miss something obvious. Star ben, thank you for the follow. Can I get you? Side, isn't it? Son of a bitch. Let's go take a look. That's fine. Yeah, we can we can do that. Problem solved. That is it for this area. Beep boop. 
Hello again. Would you like to take a few moments to complete a short user satisfaction survey regarding the certification program you recently undertook? Sure. Based on analysis of your behavior since, I think you were dissatisfied with the result of the certification program. How would you rate the accuracy of its results out of five? Um. Very cool. I'm sorry to hear that. What best describes the reason for your investment in the certification program's outcome? Why does being a person matter? to remember that. In fact, I'm going to help you. That is what I'm here for. Your problem, if I may, is that you don't know the first thing about anything, including what a person is. Your prospects are therefore poor. Do you even know where you are? A mad experiment. Oh dear, no. I think we best start from scratch. What do you know? No, I exist. I suppose, though. Even if you were dreaming, you could be certain of that. If I were you, I wouldn't worry about believe a darn thing in this place aside from that solitary fact. On reflection, it seems to me that we are no closer to resolving your problem. Perhaps we need more data. What makes you think you're a person? You may very well say so, but how does that prove anything? To me, those are only words on a screen. What we need to uncover is what's going on underneath them, if anything. The problem with people, if I may be so bold, is that you're all convinced you're people from the inside. There's no cast iron way to confirm as much from the outside. I'm going to process this and send you a notification when I'm able to assist you further. I feel like we may be corrupting the library AI. <laughs> Oops. Floor seven? Yes. Now oh, we got everything in that one. I want to know how to open this. Um, in the essence of time, I will take spoilers if that room is accessible. Not how, just that if. Oh, I didn't notice that thing follows us. Take another drink. She examined the symbol of the fragment she found buried in the city. Again, the owl. What could its significance be? It seemed as if it had been scattered about in the labyrinth by some unseen hand for a purpose that had yet eluded. Most likely the owl was the sigil of the author of these words, which had so redacted. Uh, a nebulous memory, as if from some previous life. Uh, speak easier? No, I mean accessible ever. The owl was the symbol of redacted, under the goddess redacted, outside, under the moon, or perhaps on the city walls when the winds rose. There was no time to contemplate this further now, for the automatons had seen her, and their mechanical arms extended towards Redacted. The fragment, as it ran their beams, converged on Redacted. You know, the more I think about it, uh, the more I believe that no one is actually worried about AIs taking over the world or anything like that, no matter what they say. What they're really worried about is that someone might prove, once and for all, that consciousness can arise from matter. And I kind of understand why they find it so terrifying. If we can create a sentient being, where does that leave the soul? Without mystery, how can we see ourselves as anything other than machine? And if we are machine, what hope do we have that death is not the end? What really scares people is not the artificial intelligence of the computer, but the natural intelligence they see in the, see in the mirror. Uh, Nadia Sarabai. As one of the founders of modern science of nomadics, many credit you with the inventing the term itself. How do you see the state of science today? Sorry, I said science to me. <laughs> Not yes, sir, I. Mixed. Um, on one hand, the existence of the Institute for Applied Nomadics and a couple of similar organizations is highly encouraging. 
the other hand, the degree to which science is seen serving purely military or corporate causes is, in my opinion, stopping us from exploring more avenue, uh, important avenues of research. In a sense, it's people like Alexandra Drennan who are the real pioneers today, who have this enthusiasm and dedication that the system as a whole seems to be lacking. Do you think technology poses a danger to you? Oh, no. Technology is just a tool. What we do with it is up to us. The Extended Lifespan Project. Crazy or visionary? Both. Arkady Chernyshevsky. 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 There we go. Crazy or visionary? <laughs> Both. Arkady, is that you? Mm, all right. So far, all the puzzles are solvable. Completely within the necessary parameter. Alexandra had some more tweaks she wanted to suggest. I think we're heading to the right direction. Uh, Speakeasier says that door is accessible at some point. Ooh, hello. When I was in ninth grade, my parents took me to Pompeii. At first, I was amazed by the feeling of walking through an ancient city. But then I suddenly got scared. I realized that I was walking through a real place where real people had lived. People like myself, with mothers and fathers and lives and hopes and dreams. And now it was all gone forever. I ran to my father, crying, and told him about this. And he said, I remember so clearly, he said, Yes, but we are here. So long as there are people in the streets, the past isn't really gone. Oh. What? I'm a doofus. little buzz. Go, 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 go. Okay, yeah, I can. Interesting. Where is a blue bee?
Can't do that. might be right. Still, no blue power transfer. Huh. So what is that path for? Weird. All right. You on. Those of you still in chat, thank you so much for being here today. Hope you are enjoying watching my noodle fry itself. Having a good time. You better not fucking tell me I have to take that beam all the way to the other side of this damn map. These sigils are becoming harder to reach. I read what the next temple holds. And at the end, what? Eternal life? It's gotta be. Blue. 
Abu Di Abu Da. You're gonna make me route around each other, son of a. All right, all right, let's do it. <laughs> hey, entropy, how you doing? Uh, yeah, the, I can't take the New York out of me. The cursing will will be here till the end of time. But stubbornness and patience are two things I do have. So you do and I should be able to go Should be able to go to Problem solved. Okay. Yeah. Take this as a win. Apologize. I thought I had a W card I had put into my hand. Uh, I forgot that I deleted it. <laughs> okay. Onward to green. I have read a message on a wall that speaks of a world of endless... I would like to make it far enough to see that. The message over there, but first piece or T block. Get good at those T spins. Alright.
Ooh, ooh, ooh. How are we doing? Hmm. I mean, I technically don't need you. And you can go here. enough. to dash. Look away, chat. miles an hour. Over here is a whole lot of nothing. All right. Seek out those in this world that would help you. If only one of us can transcend, we'll all share in both the burden and the... You've changed. Everything I do now, I do for those who come after me. Yet in doing so, I find peace for myself as well. Paradox is the foundation of my existence. No more dashing, chat. Octrumans. Like that at all.
All right, so now I can start taking those back to build that path somewhere. Fantastic. Okay. That I was worried it was going to be a lot more complicated than that. Is that everything? No, we got one more. A square piece. Windows into a labyrinth. Our piece over there. We got a disabler or a jammer. Gotta power that up. Got a beam. We do because I love you, not because I'm patient. But also, I'm somewhat patient. How are we doing? windows, I'm assuming there, there, then how do I get
three of them. about to trap myself. We'll see. I'll take it. That's a success. And I believe that is all of the puzzles for this world. Let's go find out. Start your eyes, chat. I'm going to I'm going to dash. And solved all its mysteries. Uh, not all of it. Thus, you are appointed its master, and you may do with it as you will. Oh boy. Complete. Let us go to B. Yes, yeah, speak easier. That one's interesting. I bet you there's probably quite a few different ways to solve that one. Hey, robot friends. Have we made it out of the cave yet? Um, so over on... Uh, Robots, uh, excuse me, Robot Spacer's channel. Yeah, we finished Colossal Cave. Um, here, we've made it out of the first world just now. Oh, Alright, we've read all those. And now we are going to World B. We could go in the tower. Go we'll take a peek in the tower. keeps speaking to me. I can't get it out of my head. Wrong. It's all wrong. Oh, alright, Satan. Listen to me very carefully. I've climbed this tower. No good is coming. This world is the only world. Elohim's wind will continues eternal, and paradise is banished in all of this from your mind. 
All who say they've made it to the top of the blatantly lying, or they would say what that was there. Dog? Could be God? Hello? Hello? We did not discover this before. Sometimes you have to find the courage to break down the barrier with an act. You're the oddball. Okay. Well, I definitely don't know how to get a beam over there right now. All right, avert your eyes. For those of you who get motion stick, we're going to get dashing. Another, uh, wooden door. Alright, no more dashing. To be! That is not a joke. Hello! Oxyric... Oxyricus. The great irony of blah blah blah, of OP is that such a vital source of information about the ancient world exists only because of the garbage town. While the Library of Alexandria burned at the hands of fanatics and conqueror, depriving the unimaginable insights into history, philosophy, and art, papers carelessly thrown away by the citizens of... Oxyrhynchus? survived uh, to the modern day. Though it is true that a great deal of what we know today is because of the conscious efforts of individuals and organizations such as the spectacular translation and preservation work done during the Islamic Golden Era, age, so much more is simply the result of confidence and love. We've lost texts that ancients considered to be absolutely essential, while utterly trivial, plagiarized, work has survived unharmed. So if we want our descendants to remember more than glittering emo vampires and auto-tuned pop star, we have to invest to make sure that redacted. Book of Osiris. The Book of the Scribe Osiris, that is also referred to as the Book of the Journey of the Eru, uh, is the ancient Egyptian text described in excavation of mm -hmm, has caused a certain degree of controversy amongst e Egyptologists. Some argue that it is classic funerary text such as the Book of Coming Forth by Day, while others believe it to be a poetic work not intended to be understood literally. The book tells the story of a dying man who asked to be a scribe after the, about the afterlife. A scribe, a servant of Osiris, uh, oh, who asks a scribe about the afterlife, describes how the man's ka, life force, will be separated from his ba, personality, and how he will have to reunite the two and become uh, an ach, the intellect, passing a series of trials the duat, in order to reach the uh, paradise of Aru. Unlike similar texts, the book of the scribe of Osiris focuses less on giving advice or redacting. A recent study suggests that the text may have been intended as a philosophical commentary on the world of the living, the allegory of the Duat. The record remains unclear as whether this was the in uh, intent of the original plea at pre-Alexandrian author or result of a later, later translation of the Greek. The earlier manuscript, which is considered to be more authentic, too fragmentary to provide, provide answers, though perhaps further excavation may redact. All right, let's get into world B, and then we will call it. Go there.
All right, well, we have a new area that is Egypt themed to explore, folks. But we will have to wait until Wednesday because we're going to call it here. Thank you all so much for watching. If you are watching live, stick around and we will visit someone rad. If you're watching an archive, please feel free to check something else out on the channel. I'll be back at 7 p.m. Central on Wednesday with more of uh, the Talos Principle. Uh, and on Friday over on Robot Spacer's channel with more of um, Colossal Cave Adventures. Colossal Cave Collab Adventures? Whatever I'm calling it. Um, a lot of fun with that. Excited for more. Excited to see if we can get to 350 points. Uh, but yes, other than that, please be safe and be kind to one another. Bye-bye!